What do you hear? What do you say? My YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Google Plus, your sister's ass, the Pony Express. Got another Mountain Dew review for you. Uh, I figured I'd give this one another shot because the last time I had it was with another flavor that was bad. And it was zero sugar, which was also bad. Never drink diet or zero sugar. If you're going to go soda, go the whole way just for the flavor. So this is take two officially. I don't think this is going to impress me. I don't remember any of the other mystery flavors really even being that good. Hmm, that's an odd smell. That's a weird scent coming out of this bottle. Wow. What the hell is that? I don't want to say it's citrusy, but it's got like a really, not sour, but like, it's like super, I don't even want to say it's sweet. It's like a weird mixture of candies. It's like, it's like that weird sour electric candy. This is probably like what old people think Mountain Dew actually tastes like, which is like energy piss water. not bad i i just can't put my my finger on what exactly it is it's it's odd for sure it's like a really muted light orange lemon kind of thing it'd be interesting they just did pumpkin right wouldn't it be cool if they just like went with the orange motif and just did pumpkin flavor that'd be cool or uh, pumpkin spice um that's a CC plus. That's interesting. I'm gonna have to keep sipping and thinking on this one. That's a uh... boy. That is a mystery because like it initially hits you with flavor, but then it just like kind of leaves you like the Mountain Dew, fresh Mountain Dew on a on a morning, like Bob Ross paintings. Nice Mountain Dew. I gotta. T this is hold on. It's not my longest review ever, even though it's just a jokey bit. What is that? All right, I'm gonna Google what that is, but uh, maybe try a can. Don't don't try the like a like a big case or a big bottle. What the hell is that? All right. Well, until next time.